Hello. So today I'm going to be reading part eight. Yeah, eight of the Prince of Southland. So I hope you guys enjoy. Oh, my word. oh who's calling him? Oh, Monday. Sorry, my phone is ringing. I thought you didn't have a phone. Monday gave it to me. Oh, shit. I forgot to update her. She's going to be so mad. Wait, how are you able to get a call in here? Yeah, actually, because aren't you in like a like a everything-proof room, like no signals can get in? Hi, Monday. I'm going to assume Donnie is with you and not still being held captive somewhere. I'm here. Hey, babe. Glad to see you in one, one piece. Sorry everything went wrong. I'm glad that Vasha's information was good, at least. It's okay. You know Vasha? I do. We don't talk often, but she knows Dawn is my friend, so she updated me. Well, that was awfully nice of her. <laughs> Sorry, I meant to call you back when we got back. I read that wrong. I meant to call you when we got back. There was a lot to talk about. We were making out. <laughs> I love her face. She's just like, oh, yeah. <laughs> Donnie, you don't have to tell her everything. <laughs> hey, making out is an excuse I'll accept. <laughs> oh, don't look so embarrassed. I would have gotten it out of Donnie eventually. Which reminds me. Can I talk to you, Donnie? Alone? Oh, uh, sure. Here, I'll wait in the kitchen. Mm. What's up? Is something wrong? Well, there's this thing going around online a picture of you during your escape i thought it was fake at first because in the picture you had have these prosthetic arms oh yeah because he was hiding them from everybody oh and surely my best friend would tell me if he had prosthetic arms seems like such a silly thing to lie about but then it kind of looks like your left arm is made of metal right now care to explain oh monday Oh, I, uh, I mean, it's not something I tell anyone, if that makes you feel better. You told Jensen. Not willingly. He found out. Is it bad? I mean, is the picture clear? Or do most people think it's fake? Donnie, I understand the stigma what, that comes with being a cyborg, but you're a wanted criminal now. Does it really matter anymore? I shouldn't have to tell people if I don't want to. I'm not saying you have to tell people. I'm trying to understand why you didn't tell me. Yeah. Mm. I was just a kid when it happened. My dad, he has a strict set of rules. And never telling anyone about my arms was number one. When I was younger, I thought he was ashamed of me. Like, who would want a kid with no arms? No. <laughs> but now, I had... But now, I think it had more to do with his own issues. Because he's a cyborg, too. Oh, my. He is? Is he? Yeah. Aftershock 12 got us both. Compound fracture in his left leg got infected. He still did interviews and stuff, pretending like it... Like he wasn't hurt. He lost it, like, a week later. Oof. That's rough. I'll make sure it gets deleted. That picture, that's what you want, right? Yeah, that's what I want. Okay, consider it done. Oh, Monday's so sweet. Really? Thanks. Oh, one more thing. You should be careful around Dale. I have no doubt they mean well, but the witch depends on Dale. She's not going to let them stay away long. Just something to keep in mind. Uh-huh. Keep your head low. Try not to stress too much. Monday, he's a wanted criminal. I think he should stress. <laughs> and call me if you need help, okay? This will all be better soon. Mm -hmm. Sure thing. Bye, Prince. Bye. Yeah. Mm -hmm. You okay? Probably not. You want to talk about it? Not really. Do you remember that day I fucked up your hair when you called me a coward for hiding my arms? Did I? 
I'm starting to think that maybe you had a good point. Hey, I said anything I could that day to hurt you. You were so close to figuring out what I really am. It doesn't, uh, doesn't make it any less true. Stop that. You can't feel guilty for keeping secrets. Not when you've been so nice about my secrets, especially when those secrets could alter your life. You know what? Yeah, he's right. <laughs> okay, okay, I get it. Do you? I actually wanted to ask you. You've been staying here since I got arrested, right? Yeah. Do you... I mean... Do you trust Del? Hmm. Huh. Does he? Mm. Okay. Just read this. Oh, okay. All right. Do I trust Dell? What's that supposed to mean? What did they do? Shh, nothing. They, they didn't do anything. It's just something Monday said. She said to watch out because the witch needs Dell. I mean, I think Dell is hiding from her as much as we are. He said he stopped working for her not long after he tried to catch us. Yeah, they did mention something about that last night. I guess I don't, I just don't trust them after everything that's happened. You know what? Yeah, yeah, I, I can see that. Hey, if you don't feel safe here, or if you want to leave for any reason, just say the word. Thanks. I'm okay, though. I'm sure I'm just being paranoid. You've been here for months, though. What's it been like living with Dell? Oh, it's been fine. I didn't actually see a whole lot of Dell unless we were act actively working on your rescue plan. We argued a lot about you, the best way to help you, and didn't talk much outside of that. Sometimes I get the sense that Dell is afraid of me. I think they expect me to just snap one day because it's possible for the wish to control me. Which isn't too far-fetched, all things considered. I mean, you do have some anger issues. <laughs> what? Am I wrong? You were ready to murder that droid yesterday. Which I can understand, I guess. But you had to had that same look in your eyes the night at the club. You would have killed Stella if I hadn't stopped you. You always hit first and ask questions later. And I do get why you do that, but it's still a problem. Yeah, Dell probably is scared you're going to snap, but not because you're a droid, because you don't know how to cope with your unresolved trauma. Yeah, and you got a lot of that, all right? <laughs> Have you ever told the full story of what happened with the witch to anyone? No. Well, you might stop feeling so angry all the time if you did. Yeah, he's right. He's just spitting facts. I'm going to make lunch. Oof. Was I too blunt? Nah, you're fine. Was he upset? Yes, but, you know, he needed to hear it. Yeah, he did. But maybe there was a nicer way to say it. What if he got mad at me? It's, uh, if not about this, then something else. What if we broke up? <laughs> no, you're not. That's not gonna happen. <laughs> then I'd have given everything up for nothing. See, you're not breaking up. No. See? Look at that. Definitely not breaking up. You're right. About me. And I'm sorry. It's okay. As long as you're working on it, I will. And then it's all good. Oh, so patient. I love it. Are you a koala now? Mm-hmm. <laughs> I am trying to make food here, you know. I'll eat you instead. Oh, my God. Guys, you gotta calm down. Oh, my God. <laughs> oh, my God. Oh, I've got to calm down. Goddamn. All right. Donnie. Hmm? Are you still down to try and disable my C3? Yeah, of course, but I thought you didn't want to. I guess not the lip bite. <laughs> I don't want us to have to keep running forever. And a moment of pain is worth a chance of freedom, right? Yeah, I think so. Then let's try it. Tomorrow. Oh, they're cutie patooties. <laughs> oh my god. I hope you didn't take those gloves off. What? <laughs> oh my god. 
Still on. <laughs> well, put some pants on, too. We're having dinner in ten. I guess we can get dressed if we have to. <laughs> Great. Now, if you'll excuse me, I have to go barf. <laughs> Ooh, a Caesar salad. Scrumptious. This is dead Caesar salad recipe. With the fried parmesan. So what? The bastard had good taste. <laughs> Sue me. <laughs> I love Dell. They're amazing. Did you just give dad a compliment? The world must be ending. He only treated you like a prince, not me. And that's only because you've been making him money since you were a toddler. Hey, I never asked to be the prince of Southland. But you still benefited from it. Hell yeah. I'm so lucky. I love his face. <laughs> oh my god. Wait, I'm confused. How is your dad making money off of you? People pay him for interviews and appearances and shit. He wouldn't be where he is now without me. I think Skunk Boy is asking for the story. The full story. Oh. There's this picture of me and my dad from when I was like three years old. It's pretty well known. Our house got leveled in Aftershock 9. I got trapped under the rubble. And right as dad pulled me out. Oh, look how tiny you were. Oh my gosh. A journalist snapped the picture. Dad had been in the news recently, cause he'd just gotten, cause he'd just bought Ursa. So the media took it and ran. They used that photo everywhere. It became something more, a symbol of hope or something. People called Dad the King of Southland before, but now it was a title of honor. Look how cute he is in his little sweater. He's so cute. And I was the little prince. He used the spotlight to help in the recovery effort and promote Ursa. Sales skyrocketed after that. He still calls it the best marketing campaign he's ever done. That was the beginning of the end of our parents' marriage. Mom didn't like Dad using her youngest child as a marketing tool. Yeah, who wouldn't? You know, who wouldn't? I mean, would. <laughs> what? <laughs> okay. <laughs> The whole situation definitely fucked with all of our heads. Yeah, I mean, look how you turned out. No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> I'm just kidding. <laughs> I didn't know all that. I mean, I grew up watching all the specials about you. All the special gents, and really, all of them. But I never knew the full thing. You watched every special about me? That's not what I said. Yeah, that's totally what you said. But you did, didn't you? You probably had a, a massive crush on me. Not a massive crush, just a regular-sized one. <laughs> oh my god, I was just kidding. You really had a crush on me? That's so cute. Really living the dream, huh, skunk boy? I'm gonna do the dishes and give you two time to stop being so gross. Stop looking at me like that. Like what? Oh my gosh. Hey, Donnie? Hmm? If something happens to me, like if the witch finds me, I don't want you to come after me. What do you mean? Come on. Just just let me go. St can you stop with this BS? You know that's not going to happen. He's like, bitch, what? What the fuck are you talking about? I'm not going to let you go. She's dangerous. And your name is worth a lot. She needs me. So whatever she does to me won't be half as bad as what she could do to you. So I want you to promise me that you won't play into her hands. He's going to play right into her hands, and you know it. <laughs> no. <laughs> right? Yeah. We're partners. In crime and in love. So only, so the only thing I can promise you is that I'll never leave you behind. No. That's really cheesy. And there's no way you can keep that promise. I can promise to try my damnedest. <laughs> oh my god. You guys are so stupid, and I love it. All right, here it is. Once I press this, your C3 may or may not be disabled and could possibly create a power surge in the process. You're sure you want to do this? I'm like 80% sure it won't hurt us, but there's always the possibility. I'm sure you're sure. I'm sure, but I still think we should probably tell Dell what we're going to do. No! Del won't be okay with this, no matter how many precautions we take. 
They're too scared of the witch to take the risk. They'll think messing with the C3 will call her here somehow, even though we're in the, the damn, uh, we're in the data vault. I'm tired of being a threat to everyone around me. If this works, it would solve so many problems. Okie dokie then. Let's do it. <laughs> oh my god. Uh oh. <laughs> oh shit. <laughs> oh god damn it. <gasps> oh, are you kidding me? Oh no, Jensen. Jensen. <laughs> he really flopped over. Jensen, wake up. What? What's going on? We got shocked and you passed out. How do you feel? Oh, that's right. I I'm okay. Are you sure? Yeah. Remember I told you I have glitches? That was one of them. If I get shocked over a certain wattage, I faint. Oh, how cute is he? <laughs> huh, I guess that makes sense. You feeling okay, though? Yeah. Oh, your C3. It's cracked. Oh, weird. Do you think that means it's disabled? I don't know. Let's check. Well, it's still working. Sorry. It was worth a shot. Thanks for trying. I'm gonna go lie down. I just need to think for a bit. Sure. You just... Okay. Well, alright. <laughs> uh, what's got your emo... Uh, your boy so emo? <laughs> He's already emo. What do you mean? Oh, just the usual droid stuff. He's holed up in the bathroom. Yeah, I'm gonna give him some space. That's smart of you. What's Jonah up to? Or is it Joanna? Joanna. Oops. What's Joanna up to? She's at work. She's a call droid down in, uh, Sanguine. I probably said that wrong. I'm so sad. <laughs> a call droid? Like a courtesan? Isn't that illegal? Laws don't matter down here, remember? She makes good money, too. She's the one keeping the lights on in this place right now. I didn't know that. Guess I should thank her. Probably better if you didn't. The witch wanted to shut her down, but I convinced her not to. So now Joe feels like she owes me. Well, that was nice of you, I guess. Yeah, it was very nice of you. Oh, <laughs> ah, what the? Is he okay? Jensen, definitely not okay. Jensen, oh my, oh my god. What are you, oh my god. <laughs> oh my god, Jensen, help. <laughs> oh jeez, Jensen, what the heck? What the heck? Oh my god. Jensen. Help me. Yeah. Oh, hell. It's starting an electrical fire. <laughs> oh, poor thing. Oh, my God. <laughs> baking soda? I need baking soda. Here. It's not working. Oh, jeez. He fainted again. Great. I have to take the glove off. Don't you dare. <laughs> oh, my God. His poor hand. His poor hand. It worked. Jensen? Put the glove back on. Can you carry him? Because you've got one minute to get out of here. Where do we go? Doesn't matter. Just get as far away from here as you can and don't come back. She'll be watching this place now. Don't go. You picked the worst possible time to play Sleeping Beauty. <laughs> Where the fuck is that gun? Oh my gosh. Oh my god. Wait, what is that? What is that? Oh no. Oh, God. Run! She's materializing. Oh, fuck. Oh, hell. Hello, little prince. I believe you have something that belongs to me. Oh, Jesus. Fuck off, witch bitch. <laughs> he doesn't belong to you. Fuck this. <laughs> right? What? What the hell? She just teleports? Where did she? Ah! It's all right. No more running. Oh, Jesus Christ. Oh, what in the world? Go to sleep, little prince. Oh, my God. Why are you feeding him drugs? Finally. Time to go home. Oh, Dale. Thank you, Dale. Thank you, Dale. Dale? Step away from them. Oh, yeah. What a, what a boss. Or the next bullet goes to your head. Why didn't you go through the head in the first place, Dale? Why don't you go straight for her head? 
Is that so? Ooh, damn, she moved fast. Oh my god. Get her, Del. Get her. Oh yeah, kill the bitch, kill the bitch. Bullets don't work anymore, love. I've upgraded. Oh shit. This is new too. Oh man, damn it. Good boy. Oh, Jesus Christ, this is awful. <gasps> drugs? Drugs? More drugs. Oh god, no. Ugh, I said never again. No more. Oh, so now you try to fight it. There's no point, Dill. You've always, you'll always be tied to me. Tied by flesh, by the blue, and by the blood on your hands. Oh, not by the ponytail. Come on. Not to mention your little friend. <gasps> oh, no. Joanna. No. Come back home, love, and I'll let her go. You're not even really here, are you? Will you come home willingly or not? Oh, fuck. Fine, you cool piece of shit. Good. I knew we could come to an agreement. Oh, my God, I can't. Oh, my gosh. Let's see if your brother can be, e can be swayed as easily. Oh, poor Dell. Oh, my gosh. Oh, what? Ugh. You're so stupid. Joanna? Try again. I don't remember what voice I gave her, but all right. Who are you? I'm the new you. The witch's right hand, because you can't be trusted anymore. Fuck off. Oh, not very friendly. Oh, hell no. I'm out of here. <laughs> Shit. Oh, my God. Why are you so mean? Ugh. That drug coursing through your system is different than any you've done before. It doesn't just slow reflexes. It messes with your silly human senses. Makes them more suggestible. That hit the witch gave you earlier? Quarter dose. Ugh. Jeez. Oh, God, Dale. Let's try the full thing, eh? Oh, no. Wait. Considering your past, just think of it as insurance. Oh, my God. You guys are so mean. So we can be sure you won't leave her again. Oh, my God. Are you kidding me? Oh, this is so bad. This is stressing me out. Oh, no, Jensen. Oh, God, Jensen. Oh, my God. Oh, where? Oh, who's pulling you to the bottom of the ocean? Who is it? You? Oh, you know, I'm. you did have a glow up. You did have a glow up. I will say you did have a massive glow up. That's not terrifying at all. You get it, Jensen. Oh, my God. Stop. Stop denying me. I've always been a part of you, and I always will. Oh, God, they're oh, so weird. You can't outrun yourself. Oh, my. Ew. Ew, 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 ew. I hate that. Ew, I actually hate that. That's nasty. Oh, my gosh. This is so cool. Welcome home. Are you finally ready? No. 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 Donnie? Donnie. Shit. What happened? Why are we out here? Jensen? Donnie? Are you okay? Don't touch me. What? What's wrong? What's wrong? You. You've lied to me over and over again. You lied. Uh, you led me on. Made me believe that you could actually love me. I deserve something real. Someone from someone who's real. Someone human. This isn't you. You'll never be real. Stop. I know it's you. Stop pretending. My God. She's such a bitch. I hate her. You're getting better at that. Now it's time to go home. Why are you, wouldn't you, like, want to use Donnie as, like, I don't know, to persuade Jensen to come with you instead of being mean to him? Like, wouldn't that be smarter? <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> I'd rather slip my own throat than go back with you. Ooh, spare me the dramatics. You know how much good we can do together, yet you're spending your time gallivanting with the prince. That is disgusting. Ew. 
You really cared about helping people once upon a time. When did you become so selfish? I learned from the best. You've never wanted to help anyone but yourself. Ooh, so angry. Does this form upset you? Yeah, it upsets me. This is disturbing and gross. I think so. What about now? Ah, you're smitten, aren't you? Shut up. I'll admit I'm surprised. You're not the type to get attached. What makes him different? Stop it. You know nothing about Donnie. And you're doing a piss-poor impression of him. Is that so? What if I said I've known Donnie for years? For longer than you? Bullshit. Believe what you want to believe, love. You're talking too much. You're stalling. Donnie, where are you? I'm right here. Shut the fuck up. <laughs> You're not even tall, to be, tall enough to be him. <laughs> That's so true, isn't it? Ew, stop, I hate that. I know what you're doing. You're not even here. Is that so? Not yet, anyway. You don't seem phased. The real you must be close. Oh, wait, oops, I read that wrong. You don't seem phased. The real must you must be close. Or you real or bleh, or you just really like toying with me. What did you do with Donnie? Nothing, I bet. He's too valuable. Use water. That's the only way to disrupt the hologram. Shut up. Oh yeah. Gear. You flinched. That means there's no that means there's a way to damage the hologram. I've missed you, Jensen. You always put up a good fight. Oh my god. Ugh. Oh yeah, roundhouse. She's so creepy, but I love this art so much. It's so cool. Donnie. Donnie, wake the fuck up. Oh, fuck. Enough playing around. It's almost time. What? Oh, shit. Ugh. I've let you have your fun, but you can't escape fate, darling. Put me down. The fate of my decision, my design. It's time for you to do what you were made to do. What? Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Ah! Oof. Concussed. Ugh. Hurry. Before she recovers. I promise it's me. And not the witch pretending to be me. Yeah, he knows that. Prove it. The night we met, you called me a uh, masked one. You play piano really well. The back of your neck is really ticklish. One time you told me vodka is the, sh the, is the only straight thing like you. <laughs> all right, all right. <laughs> Do we lose her? Uh, what the hell is that? It's her, not just a hologram. The real her. Oh, fuck me. Oh, no. This is bad. Oh, jeez. We have to hide. No, keep running. You think the witch can out- uh, You think we can outrun the witch? It's her mask. It can see through almost anything. We can't run forever. You're not even wearing shoes. I'm telling you, if we stop moving, she will find us. Follow me. Oh, hi, Vasha. I don't remember what voice I gave you either. Who are you? It's okay. I know her. In here. She won't find you here. Are you sure? The walls are lined with lead, and that door only opens for me. She has no way of seeing or getting in here. So, thank you. Yeah, they're both asthmatics. <laughs> uh-huh. You owe me. Again. Again? Uh, yeah. I'm the one who figured out where those bounty hunters took you the other day. You're welcome. Oh, thanks for that. Uh, I'm Donnie, by the way. I know who you are. She's such a bitch. <laughs> okay. I need to double check security. Stay here and don't touch anything. Was it something I said? Sorry. <laughs> I think she's always like that. <laughs> I love his face so much. Do you really think we're safe here? Yeah, I do. I I heard all that shit the witch said to you. Oh. And I saw her pretending to be me. It looks so real. She even sounded like me. How did she do it? I'm not sure. It's gotta be some kind of highly advanced droid map. 
uh, masked by holograms. That's how it was still able to sucker punch me. And what did she mean? It's time for you to do what you were made to do. What were you made to do? I don't know. Really? Because it kind of seems like you know something. <laughs> and you promise not to lie anymore. I have a few ideas, okay? But I'd rather not get into them right now. That's okay. We can talk about it later. He's so sweet to him. Oh, uh, okay. Sorry. She just, she always knows how to get under my skin. Mm-hmm. Look at that, so sweet. Oh, his poor burnt hand still. I feel so bad. I hope you know not to trust anything she said. I know. I'm proud of you for standing up to her. Thanks. Yeah, it was not easy. <laughs> oh, the witch is still out there, circling with that ship. The Onyx Blake. Black? Blake? I don't know. It's high tech. You two wouldn't stand a chance. Thank you. <laughs> You're lucky I found you when I did. But she's not going to give up anytime soon. You'll have to hide uh you'll have to hide until she leaves which could uh which could take a few hours or a few days well we really appreciate you letting us stay no you're not staying here not for free what is it that you want vasha just spit it out i want to know what you know about the witch everything and not just stories you know it's actually kind of fair because considering like they're heavily involved, and you don't know what's coming up. Also, what happened to your ear, girly? Oh. Uh, I want a copy of your memories. Oh, that seems a little invasive. Um, how about no? All right. Okay, so I think that's where I'm going to stop for now. So I hope you guys enjoyed, and I'll see you in the next part.